For Christmas, Fern Cotton announced that she was leaving Celebrity Juice after 10 years. It's going to allow her lots more time for other projects, not least being a best-selling author. And her latest self-help book, Quiet, is out right now. And she's here. It's so good to see Hi, you. Lorraine. Quiet. You have got... I mean, this is a brand new career. You've been coming... You've become a real kind of self-help expert the reaction has been astonishing yeah i, mean, I never set out for it to be no. self-help in any way it's just no. kind of me documenting my feelings sure. and and talking sort of authentically about things that i've struggled with or enjoyed and it's <laughs> sort of naturally turned into three books for sure what's the what would you want people to take away from this fair um i think we all deal with that sort of omnipresent inner chatter that sort of mental voice that talks down to us, tells us we're not good enough or hinders us in life. And I certainly deal with that a lot. Mm. So it's basically my account of that and things that I've found useful. It's certainly not preachy. I haven't got it sus <laughs> like I have no mental chatter. <laughs> it is still very much there. Yeah, yeah. But I think it's just sort of helping people connect with that and recognise mm. those voices, understand them a bit better and then work out what they could do to help reduce them or at least sort of accept them, really. Yeah. Because I think everybody with very few exceptions, everybody's just struggling a little bit, yeah. especially at the moment. Oh, January's hard. Yeah, and also, yeah. just there's such a lot of noise in the world. There is, and All because the of social media, and I'm not blaming it because I love it, but social media and, mm. and our ability to connect with so many other people that we don't even know, mm. You know, that just enhances all of it. It's going to create even more comparison and, you know, um, more moments where you do think you're not doing the right thing or you're not living life in the right way. And, and I fall into that category like everybody else. Mm. So I thought it was a good time to, to sort of document how I felt about this. And, and there's practical exercises sure. in there where you can jot down your thoughts and, and your feelings to help you really... And just have a bit of quiet. Them. Silencing the brain chatter, that's what I like. We that's why I really that. like your podcast, because it's like Thank that. And, and when you hear other people who you think are having the best time oh, in the world, yeah. and, you know, they're golden people, and then you talk to them and you think, oh, well, they're having these problems as well. Yeah, it, you know, it you can feel steal, better. Completely, because you can steal the sort of shininess of, of people's jobs or their lives, sure. but underneath there's all the same stuff going on, worries, fears, um, you know, hindrances in life, and, and that's why I love doing the podcast, just having those genuine chats really with good. people. Thank and it's a, and it's a nice long time. We can actually get... Yeah, it's a good hour, yeah, juicy hour. You can really, you really get yeah. right in there and, and talk to them. Now, look, Celebrity Juice, mm. have you decided to go? Is it is it too silly now? Are you too grown oh, up? Oh, God, no. Oh, my God, no <laughs> way. I don't feel like I've grown up at all. Um, no, I, I did 10 brilliant years there. And really? I, it's been 10, 10 years? years. Wow. We did 20 series. Um, and I, I loved it so, so much, and I, I'll walk away missing the gang massively mm. but I think you need to have change and have a shake up in life every now and again yeah. and take risks and feel a bit scared again <laughs> it was the same when I left Radio 1 you know I That's kind of true. left on a bit you of a did. high you and did. wanted to try something new have a new adventure so it's very much um with that sort of feeling yes. attached to it but I'll, I'll miss everyone massively oh no absolutely yeah. you'll be and all the silly games and you'll, things I was made to do you'll be difficult to replace oh, I wonder you. who I wonder who they'll get I don't know yet I, I, I genuinely either. have no idea I've been I asked either. a lot no a idea <laughs> <laughs> just like, it could be you, Lorraine. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I might be too silly. Even for, <laughs> even for celebrity juice, I might be too, too silly and too naughty for them. I'm Maybe. not sure. You never, you never can tell. So, look, are we going to see more of this kind of thing, of you doing more of this yeah. sort of thing, the podcast, you know, talking yeah. about things? Because I know how passionate you are about getting people to, to open up and talk about mental health and Definitely. make it less of a taboo. I'm very passionate about it and it's something that I spend my whole life thinking about. So I don't know what will happen next. I'd love to do more books, sure. certainly more podcasts. That's happening right now. Um, and there's other ideas tinkering away. You know, it's a, it's a very broad, nebulous area, really. There's lots of subjects to cover and lots of people to talk to. Yeah. So... I'm sort of driven by that passion more than anything to, to mm. have those conversations and open them up more, do more work with Mind and the great yep. charities I work with too. Well, it so. helps It helps others, but I would imagine it also helps you as well. It massively helps It probably me. helps you with your relationship, with your husband. It helps you with, the, with everything, everything, every everything. aspect of your life. Absolutely. I think just chatting in general has such power. So, yeah, more of that. Fantastic. Well, Fern, thank you. Thank you, Lorraine. It's always a joy to talk to you. You always make me feel better. And this is oh, really good. You. It's really sensible. I don't feel as if in any way you were at any time talking down to me and I can hear your God, voice. No. But I because I'm in it too, I'm not going to you know, my yeah. life is perfect and I've sussed cool. it all. Listen to me waffle no. on. It's you know, it's just me saying, God, I find this really hard and this was a tough time and this is why. And maybe yeah. people can connect with that and it will resonate in some way and hopefully give people solace in some That's shape. That's all I hope for, really.